and welcome to Everlasting Gifts TV. I'm Jody. I'm Erin. We're so happy to see you here today. Yes. Yeah. Y'all so much mean so much. Y'all yeah. so much. <laughs> <sighs> yeah. These seven o'clock videos, man. <laughs> Words. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they seem to escape into the yeah, atmosphere. Flizzle away. So, today, we're going to talk about jack-o'-lantern. Jack! Oh. Lanterns! And where, um, at least this one story, where he Turnips. originated from. Well, okay, so originally things were carved from turnips and squash mm -hmm. and things like yeah. that. But when we moved to the United States, or when oh, the Pilgrims okay. came over, yeah. Native Americans were growing pumpkins. Yes. And that's where pumpkins started to be carved. Fascinating. Isn't that fascinating? Yeah, um, because pumpkins and things like that weren't in Europe. Yeah. Interesting. Mm -hmm. So carve your turnip. Yeah, yeah. There was another But the pumpkins last longer thing. than a turnip. True. Yeah. yeah. So anyway. I pulled up this story of the legend of Stingy Jack. Okay. Okay, and this is, you know, one of those places where they say the jack-o'-lantern came from. Okay. So I thought this was kind of a funny one. You got to read the newsletter. You know, we'll give you the cliff notes. But um, so the Stingy Jack guy, like, goes out partying with the devil. <laughs> okay. Right? And um, so the devil's out drinking with him. And um, Stingy Jack... <laughs> Doesn't want to pay for Were anything because he's stingy. Were they in Georgia? No. Oh, the devil would die. I get it. <laughs> She's so funny. Um, so he convinced the devil to turn himself into a coin to pay for the booze. Right? I know. I know. Okay. The devil in this story, not a smart guy. <laughs> <laughs> so the devil did it, and um, Jack decides <laughs> to just keep the money. <laughs> Right? So he's walking around with the devil in his pocket. <laughs> <laughs> and he put a silver cross in there so that the devil wasn't able to transform himself oh, okay. back into... Okay, that was going to be my next yeah. question. Is okay, so... It, awkward. It, 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 yeah. Just, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. Um, so, eventually, Stingy Jack frees the devil. Okay. The devil's a little upset. Yeah. Okay. Right? And so... Uh, <laughs> So Stingy Jacks asks for a year because the devil's like, give me your soul. Okay. Right. And so he asks him for a year. And uh, so after the year is up and the devil, again, not a very smart devil here, comes to claim the soul. And so uh, Jack tricks the devil into climbing into a tree. And then so he carves a cross on the tree to trap the devil in the tree. <laughs> I uh, I'm losing all faith in the devil. <laughs> seriously, seriously. He's not the smartest guy ever. Well, my soul's in the tree, but you gotta go get it. <laughs> so, but he left him in there for 10 years. <laughs> right? So, but during this 10 years, Stingy Jack dies. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, yeah, yeah. And so, so his as, soul's just out there free and wandering around? Right, and so... Well, so he's such an unsavory, as the word here says, because I would not come up with something that's more her game. He's such an unsavory <laughs> soul that even God doesn't want him. <laughs> right? And so <laughs> the devil's all upset. He don't want him either. Um, so what he does is he, like, pretty much condense him to darkness. Okay. Right? So that's kind of where the jack-o'-lantern thing comes yeah. from. Um, I believe he gives him a turnip, though, or something. Let me read right here. Mm -hmm. He sent him in the night um, with a carved-out turnip. And so huh? he's been roaming the earth in the dark with his turnip ever since. <laughs> so the Irish yeah. began to refer to this ghostly figure as Jack of the Lantern, and then it simply became jack-o'-lantern. Fascinating. Yeah, I like it because the devil's just an idiot. Yeah, I know. Right? <laughs> <laughs> <It's just> <laughs> don't oh. <gasps> she cussed. She said the A word. I was talking about donkeys. Yeah. Anyway, uh, entertaining story. I know there's other jack o' lantern stories right. out there, but yeah. I thought that one was kind of funny. That. Stingy so, Jack. Yeah, Stingy Jack. Um, yeah. He, so funny. Yeah. So. Here we have. There's a stingy jack for you. I like how the, oh. <laughs> the tag, the tag has become his tongue. He's like drooling. Red. Oh. 
Oh, I retaped it, but I guess it didn't last. <laughs> okay. It, it didn't take. <laughs> so here. <laughs> yeah. Here's our... That's our orange calcite. And you were just reading about orange, because, you Yes. Because of orange stones. Yeah. And what cool stuff. Yes. Well, enlighten us with your orangeness. Okay. They're all about creativity and warmth. They're a good pick-me-up stone for when you're feeling a little low, or in the dead of winter, or maybe fall. I don't know. If you're feeling a little yeah. sun deprived, they're a warm, sunny stone. They're good, good for communic. Or no, 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 no. Wait, what was it? Oh, self confidence and emotional communication. So if you need to have an emotional conversation with somebody, <laughs> hang on to a orange stone, a sunstone skull. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's a really good, happy pick-me-up. Yeah, we like our sunstone around here. Yeah. We have lots of skulls, you guys, so, you know, a couple days till Halloween. Everybody has one. Yeah. Um, and then, <laughs> it took me a minute, but I got it. I got it. Okay. And Carnelia, which is also <laughs> vitality. <laughs> And it's a stone of ambition. It is. I know. You think as many times if we've shown it on our videos that we just know that. The stone of ambition. Woo! Yeah. 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 Uh, we need an end of a long day brain stone. Well, I pulled orange cyanide. It doesn't say anything like that. It's uh, it's good for life force. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. They're all kind of energy. Right. Right. Like, you know, an so, orange, you know, when you think of the go. sun, right? You know, mm -hmm. orange happy. And this is orange kyanite, guys. We got little chunkies of it. Yeah, and I read a little blurb about how the monks in, you know, India, Thailand, Nepal, that kind of thing, that dye their robes orange. It's because oh, uh, leaves yeah. fall, and so it's to symbolize uh, detachment and not. Um, no, I, I get what you mean. Free of right, you know, right, all whatever. earthly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Simply shackles. Yes. Yes. So that's, you know, like your Jack story, I'm sure there's lots of <laughs> reasons why they dye their robes orange. Right. <laughs> I like that one, though. Yeah. 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 yeah that was a good one. I know. I thought that was oh. kind of cool. Well, and we do have lots of fun stuff here, you guys, um, for Halloween, two days mm -hmm. away. I can't believe it's already right. here. Oh, my gosh. So maybe you like... Cacaw. 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 <laughs> I'm thinking of when the murder of crows goes over my house oh at night. Oh, my and God, yes. Like, eh, eh, eh. Yeah. yeah. So, raven, <laughs> crow. Of course, bats. I'm trying to think of a bat sound. <laughs> flap, flap, flap. I don't know. Yeah, I know. Um, hoo hoo. <laughs> she, look, she's got the owl down. I want to hear what sound she's going to make for spiders. Isn't that more like a rat? Okay. Well, that's his little face. And here's her skull. This one comes with complimentary googly eyes. <laughs> and you know what's funny? Everyone thought Jody did it, but it was me. Oh, I know. And I'm like, no, this time it wasn't me. <laughs> and if you're more of a softy, we do have hearts. Yes. Yeah. So lots of black, lots of orange. Lots um, of good stuff. Yeah. For the upcoming holiday. Yeah. Cauldrons, incense, Ooh. candles. Oh, yeah. Got all of your, your witchy wares for witchy Samhain. Witchy wares. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. Salon is coming oh, up, yeah, too. Oh, yeah, that's yeah, true. Same yeah, day. Good point. <laughs> Boom. Yeah, interlocking, um, which is New Year. Yes. Peggy yes. New Year. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I, I know I've been posting some stuff about that on our Facebook. Yep. Or, well, it's actually going to come up in a couple of days. I posted it already, but you haven't seen it. <laughs> <laughs> um, and I did come up with a really cool, I'm calling it pumpkin energy oil. And my goal was to make it smell like pumpkin pie, and it actually came out smelling really good. Nice yeah. and sweet and wonderful. It's got clove like and that. cinnamon and palmarosa and chamomile um, and yeah. whatever. I, I did yeah. apricot, but whatever oil you want. Okay. Um, but, yeah, just nice and sweet and just kind of makes you feel warm and fuzzy, you know. And yeah. Yeah, kind of like, like you're baking a pie. You it, could throw you an know. orange stone in it. Like a carnelian. Oh! There you go for vitality like and energy. A, woo woo. You're a genius. Oh my god, I want to be like I you. I know. I'm so, so much like you. Okay. So no anyway, class this week. No class. Because everyone needs to go trick or treat. Yep. Yep. Come in here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think I'll probably bring some goodies. 
Yeah, I thought about getting some candy last yeah. night, and then I got sidetracked, you know, and yeah. forgot to get the bag of candy. Yeah, yeah. I bought candy corn last year. Nobody was impressed. <laughs> it was on sale. Candy corn's like the, you know. The what? The last kid picked for a team. Yeah. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> Is that why it was on sale? Probably. <laughs> Less than a dollar at the right. dollar store. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, so we'll have treats. Yeah, and you know. Of some sort. Yeah, no harm done to you candy corn lovers out yeah, there. Right, no. Yeah, we still love you. <laughs> <laughs> or do we? <laughs> All right, guys. Okay. Have a lovely Halloween and a blessed. Happy, happy. Salon and, and Day of the Dead and the Night of Souls, Day of Souls, Scorpio Moon, whatever, and, all yeah. of the good fun stuff that's yeah. coming up. Yeah. Harvest, you know, whatever. Harvest time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, bye. Till next week. <laughs>